another good day. Very excited about the uh, progress of our team. Looking forward to uh, getting up there and, and uh, embracing what I promise will be a raucous uh, environment and one that uh, hopefully we'll embrace and get off to a good start because I think a good start will be important and, and uh, see if we can uh, get ourselves our fifth win. Games you've had success in, you got off to a good start. Maybe you haven't, you haven't got off to a good start. Is there anything that you can uh, chalk up to that, maybe? Well, up until we've only been ahead and uh, scored the first points in two of the games that we've won. Uh, so uh, I just, you know, I, I don't want to put all the eggs. It has to be a perfect start to, before we can win the game. I want to make sure that everybody knows that uh, we're going to play the full 60 minutes and and uh, we're going to find a way. That's that's uh, the ultimate challenge uh, for when you're on the road is to go up there and hang around and hang around and see if you can uh, take the game over. You guys are using a pretty heavy rotation in the defensive backfield. Are you guys trying to keep people fresh? Well, uh, we're fortunate that we have, a, you know, we've developed some depth with the attrition. Uh, some other guys have had to step up and they've become really good players for us. So we want to make sure we keep our guys uh, fresh and. And, and we know that they're uh, a big play offense. They've got a lot of balls down the field type of uh, air, air uh, show, and, and it's important that uh, we stay fresh. You guys have had success playing in kind of cold and, and nasty conditions before. Is that something you kind I'm of I'm going like? in and reminding us that we have, too. Is that uh, something you've come to like, almost? Uh, it's, it's uh, you know, I think if you take the right attitude for it, it's, it's certainly unusual for us. It's not something we do all the time. But over the years, UCLA has always gone on the road, in my mind, since I was a part of this program, and, and uh, had some big success in, in bad weather. Uh, we went up to Washington in the early 90s with, and, and made a field goal to beat, I think, the number two ranked Huskies at the time uh, in a terrible day. Uh, and in the last year, we went on the road to both the Washington State and the Eagle Bank Bowl and, and, and played in really, you know, uh, cold environments and, and found ways to still win the game. So hopefully uh, we are up to the task again. If it's wet, is that a different challenge? Well, you know, it, it's wet for both teams. You know, I, I, we've been able to, to, to be successful without much in the way of throwing you the ball. And so uh, we'll see if we can do it again. If you mean to, but usually wet doesn't necessarily mean you can't throw it. It just means you got to keep the ball dry. And, uh, but, but the ability to run the ball becomes more important, no question. It's the biggest joke of all time. Man's playing. I'm telling you. <laughs> is that insider information? No, it's just this. It's just the way it is. Just can you talk about intangibles a little bit and what he can do? Just kind of. He's got them all. He's got them all. You name an intangible, he's got it. I mean, he's uh, he's a very very uh, talented young man. He's going to have a uh, a lot to uh, a lot to. I think he'll he'll play a lot of games after the, this one. Well, I don't think you can put it all on him. Obviously, uh, they've talked about his health, but but uh, you know, it's this is a tough league. It's a tough league, and and uh, I still think he's going to be picked very very high. What's uh, Steve Sloan's availability? Steve will be ready. Steve will be ready to go, and and uh, we're excited that he's back. Anyone else? Uh, Nelson's you know much better, and and Sheldon's much better. So hopefully, all those guys are full speed. Very little. <laughs> the timetable for Kevin Prince eventually? Uh, no, I, I really haven't. Cons I know he's out for the year, so uh, I'll worry about spring ball when that time comes. But uh, for right now, just want him to get good grades and get healthy. Since the last game, it was a win, obviously. Now two out of the last three to get to a bowl game. Do you, do you notice in, in the last 10 days or so an increased sense of urgency in, in practice? I don't know that urgency is the right word. Certainly a... Uh, an enthusiasm, an excitement to, to finish the season strong. And, and uh, we need to capitalize that. We've had great pra practice and preparation, and now we need to go focus. And that's what I need to talk to him about, making sure that we go out there. Because we were excited to play at Oregon, but we didn't focus very well. And that's what's uh, got to be different this weekend. Did you see anything before that Oregon game? Did you think that? No, I just watched the tape. You know, we didn't, we weren't doing what we practiced we had to do. And we've got to make sure that the environment doesn't get us out of that. Got to be mature enough to handle that. Everybody good? All right, Thank thanks. You.